Hey guys, uh, we're here today to do a little another modification to my little Arctic 65 here. Going to put this Molly webbing, uh, attach it to our cooler, okay? Basically we're just installing snaps, you know, uh, probably four, four, one or two here, one or two here, and if you snap it on, snap it off. Anyway, um, got this from Chief, uh, I think it's Chief.com or something, it's a hazard4.com, you know, a uh, little tactical molly webbing sheet. I'm just going to center it and put it right there. What you're going to need to get started is that the actual snaps themselves. Um, you can get these, I picked these up at Ace. And you sandwich it, making sure that the snap part's going to be on the back. This part is back here at the back. And uh, anyway, we'll go from there. Uh, the first thing you're going to want to do is pre-punch some holes. Let's go ahead and do another one about here. You can use a drill or whatever to do this, but nice size nail seems to work pretty good. Anyway, we'll get that. You'll need the little set, the little punch and everything to do it as well. Get your snap, which will go on this side. a tight fit you know there's not a whole lot of this thing's pretty thick and that's you know that's all of that so it does work I've put one on again make sure the snap portions back here grab your little set make sure I have that in there right Voila, it's, uh, it's in it pretty good. I'm going to go ahead and tap it a couple more times. Okay, we've got two down. I'm not going to bore you with the rest of this, but I'm going to go ahead and put two here, two here, one, one, and probably one and one. And we're going to be good to go. Before, well, yeah, we'll be good to go. So, again, next time you see this, it'll have uh, at least 10 snaps on it. Okay, we've got our uh, sheet all prepped with the snaps. I'm not sure how I did this, but could have swore I got 10. I got 9 snaps, so I'm going to go back later and add this one more on. Anyway, what we do now is get this thing centered. And take your time on this for sure. Hold it very still. In fact, you may even want to tape it down. All we're going to do is just slightly mark these. With a screw. I mean, just barely. You can do it with a pencil too. But it's more of a starter thing for me. Before we mark all these, I'm going to go ahead and sink four of these in here for the make sure they're good and straight and they go in. I 
By the way, these are a pretty short screw on it for obvious reasons. Regular small Phillips head. One more for now. snapped in place for now. I'll go ahead and drill out the other ones. Cool. Let's move at all. One I don't have. Go ahead and put on. And voila, we are finished. A little treasure chest. And there we go with a few items attached. You know, it doesn't take any time to do. I just think it's kind of neat. Why not, you know? Um, guess what's always with you? Your phone. You know, whatever in that. Uh, first aid. The crowd I run with, this comes in real handy, trust me. Anyway, uh, if you guys decide to do it, it's a piece of cake. It's very easy. It's just a mole sheet. Uh, this particular one's a Hazard 4. Pretty sure it was Chief.com or something like that. Hey guys, here's a... Uh, also, I was able to not only put it on my uh, Arctic 65, but also put the same template on my little uh, Yeti roadie. So I can take it off my 65, snap it right on my, my Yeti roadie. Um, got all these off uh, uh, Amazon. You know, pack your little cork screw in there. Got your wallet. Got your phone. And your tunes, of course. The little UE boom fits in that pretty good. Anyway, um, turned out pretty good. A little place for your keys. You can also put your keys over here. The Molly mat also comes with two of these. You can actually hook your keys on that as well. Anyway, it turned out pretty good. There's another place for keys. Um, put the little dive skin on it and something else I did on this was kind of cool these are not designed to get uh, to hold a basket if you find a basket like this one which I got off Amazon pretty cheap nine and an eighth inches overall on the basket it wedges in here pretty perfectly I did put a little Gorilla Tape here and here just to kind of keep it from slipping. I keep my limes, beer salt, stuff like that in there. But I end up using this a lot more than I do the 65. Also, if you mount your bottle opener, mount it inside, don't put it outside. You just open it up, the caps are in there. You don't have to worry about anything left behind. You know, keep it clean. Leave no trace. 
anyway just kind of a little pimp on this uh pimp my yeti so to speak and um anyway yeah i think it's worth doing i mean sure it adds a little weight to it once you get everything down but the things are heavy anyway so anyway give it a shot see what you think um happy trails later